Hello everyone, in this uh, experiment I'm going to determine the average velocity of a trolley traveling down a ramp. Let us, we see that introduction. So what we do, we draw the graph of distance time graph and plot the points and connect that points and take any two points on the graph and find the slope. A purchase that we need trolley but this is a trolley and uh, runway, this is runway. Two light gates, but we don't have light gates, so we use stopwatch. Let us, we start. We started to put the trolley at 10 centimeter. Yeah, we adjust it at 10 centimeter. And then, after 10 cm, it means at 20 cm, we put that mass. So, that mass at 20 cm, it means the distance between the trolley and that mass is just 10 cm. Now, we start the stopwatch, we adjust it to zero. Yeah, and then we start. The time is 0.01 second. So this is the time of the first 10 centimeter. So that are the results of this experiment. When the displacement is 0.1 meter, the time is 0.01. Okay, now we draw the graph of displacement versus time. So we plot the graph. On my axis is the displacement in meter and on X axis it is the time in second. Because that time is very small time, so we can multiply by 100. So it becomes here 1, 1 1.6 and so on. So the scale must be the same. Each one centimeter on my axis represents 0.1. So this is 0 0.1, 0 0.2, and so on. Each one centimeter on x axis represents one. So one, two, three. And remember, it's multiplied by 10 to the power negative two. We plot the points. That are the points. We draw a curve. Of course, start at zero because when the time is zero, the displacement is zero. We take that two points, join between that two points, and find the slope of that line. Now, this is the triangle. The slope equals y2, which is 0 0.5, minus y1, which is 0 0.2, over x2, which is 2, but remember, we have to multiply by 10 power negative 2, minus this point down, it's 1.4. So all of this, we have to multiply by 10 to the power negative 2. Now we calculate the slope. The answer is uh, 50. So this is here the average velocity. Average velocity, it's 50 meter per second. I hope you understand this experiment. Thank you.